Hello guys, welcome to Thwip. My name is Munazil and today we are going to be talking about a topic we receive a lot of questions about. How to get into comics. With half the movies, TV shows, everything in media being based upon comic books, a lot of people get curious as to how to start reading more about these characters that they have fallen in love with. The easiest answer to that is to pick up a comic book and start. But it can be daunting as hell. Comic books are the largest collaborative form of storytelling ever attempted by human beings and they have been around for 80 years. The barrier to entry is extremely high, but the good news is, you don't have to read every single comic book ever to understand the story. If your entry point is a movie or a TV show, you already know about the characters enough to enjoy their stories. You know Peter Parker is Spider-Man or Bruce Wayne is Batman, you can understand any Spider-Man story or any Batman story. But the trick is knowing how to start. Will picking up a certain issue that came out today help you understand the story? Probably not. Let me explain. Comic books are the ultimate long form storytelling medium. Hundreds of writers over decades have written the numerous characters that exist and as such the story has continued over the last 80 odd years. Now every series releases a chapter of this long running story every month. This chapter is called an issue. It's about 20 to 25 pages long. When six of these issues are collected to form one story arc, it's called a trade paperback. When multiple trade paperbacks are collected in one overarching book, it's called an omnibus. Let's talk about one other aspect, graphic novels. Graphic novels are essentially a mini-series, a complete story told in 6-20 to 20 issues and usually released as a collection. It's a novel told with the help of pictures basically. It's a complete story in and of itself. It is not, as we say in the business, an ongoing. But are superhero comics all that there are? No. Cape comics might be the most popular genre, but any genre you can imagine has stories in comics. Science fiction, music, romance, comedy, horror, or any combination in between have stories in comics. Stories are as endless as your imagination. So going back to ongoing comics. Spider-Man started in 1962 and has had an issue come out every single month since then till today. In all those decades, a lot of writers have written these stories. When a writer and artist combination work on multiple chapters in sequence, whether it be 10 issues or 100, it's called a run. Every run is designed to be a jumping on point. While they will be influenced by what has happened before, they are crafted in a way that you will be able to follow along. Anything old that is referenced will be explained. So if you start with Tom King's Batman run, it is not necessary to read Scott Snyder's preceding run to understand Tom King's run. But if you have read it, it will enhance your enjoyment. And even then you all have the internet. Just type and look up any questions you might have about any character. Just start wherever you want in the world of comics and look up whatever you want to know. Or you know, just messages. So what do you want to read? That's completely up to you. Think about your favorite movie or TV show. So if it's a superhero comic, think about which superhero movie you enjoy. Go with that. If you enjoy Star Wars, read the Dark Horse stuff or the Marvel issues that are coming up. Just think about what you enjoy and then there is something for you in the world of comics. It is quite figuratively endless. Just start. There is no wrong or right way of doing this. Over the next couple of weeks, we'll be doing recommendations for beginners as to where to start. I hope this short video helped you out and you will be checking out our videos where we'll recommend what to read. So please subscribe if you like this, it would really help us out. And good luck on your comic reading journey. Just remember, we are with you. For questions and comments, hit us up whenever you feel like it. Tipping out of here now, talk to you later guys.